Imagine for a second if Link was a crow. Hello everyone and welcome to Action RPG. I am your host Aaron and for today's video we're going to be checking out a brand new RPG from developer Acid Nerve titled Death's Door. Ooh, and I wasn't kidding. Feels like Zelda but with crows. Well, kind of like that. You'll see what I'm talking about when you check out the trailer. Now the trailer for this game I've probably watched it three or four times. It's very unique. It's very engrossing. I have to tell you, every time I watch it, I notice something different. And today we're going to be talking about what we know about the game so far, and of course, checking out that trailer. As always, I will share my thoughts. Please feel free to share yours in the comment section below, and don't forget to subscribe to support smaller channels. All right, let's jump right into this. Right now, we are on IGN. Title this article, Titan Souls developer revealed their next game, Death's Door. Death's Door is looking to provide a charming, dark humor adventure, and I think you all are going to be intrigued by this game. In Death's Door, players take on the role of a crow's, crow whose 9 to 5 is collecting souls of beings at the end of their life as a reaper, but that role becomes a challenge for the crows when nothing is being reborn due to nothing dying naturally. That is until the player bird enters a realm that no longer has death and is overflowing with powerful beings in need of final rest. Really interesting story. It's full of hidden touches and big secrets. The collected souls of the defeated enemies act as currency. With enough, players can upgrade their crow's speed, weapons, and other stats in the grayscale hub world called Hall of Doors, the realm the crows occupy. From there, players can enter doors as they're unlocked to jump to specific areas in a colorful open world where they fight bosses for souls, encounter kind forest spirits, or run around and try to find the game's collectibles, shiny things. If you go and explore after you've got a new power, you can find these little trinkets in the game. You get this nice little model to look at that'll have lore attached to it. Some of them maybe give you clues that can be used somewhere else for other puzzles and things. Okay, so that is a overview for the game Death's Door. Now I'm going to play for you the actual trailer for the game. I hope you enjoy it as much as I did. Right, come on, tell the truth. You enjoyed that trailer a lot more than you thought you were going to. Come on. I don't know, maybe I'm way, way off. Right now we are on Death Door's official Steam page, which of course we have to look at since it now exists. Reaping souls of the dead and punching a clock might be monotonous, but it's honest work for a crow. The job gets lively when your assigned soul is stolen and you must track down a desperate thief to a realm untouched by death where creatures grow past, far past their expiry. 
Now, the release date for this game right now is summer 2021. So it's actually not too far away. And of course, anytime we get a Steam page, we have to look at the system requirements. But unfortunately, right now, there is nada. Looking at the visuals, I would think the system requirements aren't going to be too crazy for this game. I mean, it does look pretty good, but I'm sure it's not going to be anything out of this world. All right, everyone, that's the video, short and sweet. What do you think of Death's Door? Is this a game you see yourself playing? Is it intriguing enough for you? Are the developers taking it in the right direction? Let me know in the comment section below. If you have not joined the official Action RPG Discord yet, please do so. We're now over 800 members, great conversations every day. The idea is to create a gaming community that could jump from game to game together, so you never start the server alone. Link for that Discord is in the description. I hope you all enjoyed this video and have an excellent Monday. Stay home, stay safe. Do not forget to join the official Action RPG Discord. Aaron.